Hey friend, welcome back to my channel. My name's Molly and I'm a fifth grade teacher who helps other teachers just like you start and grow your own online tutoring business so you can make extra money every month without giving up your day job. And part of what I love helping teachers do inside of their tutoring business is finding ways to work less but make more. So hear me out. I teach full time. You guys know that I'm switching from first grade to fifth grade here pretty soon. And I have kind of hit a point where I want to make a lot more in passive income and not have to trade so much time for money. And I know that you probably are feeling that way too. It's so nice to recharge your batteries during the summer, but thinking about having a full plate again just makes me exhausted. So Today, I'm going to teach you how to turn your unique teaching gifts into a product. I think one of the best things we can do as teachers is help other teachers. And so if you can find what's so unique about the way you teach something or different and turn it into a TPT product or a course that helps people just like you, you're going to not only make more money passively down the road, but you're also gonna be helping people and that's just a total win-win. So here are my tips today for how to get that done. So I want you to take the thing that you're the most confident in teaching in the classroom and brainstorm all the things that you're great at. So just write them down. And then you'll get to the point where you can have your top three things. So let's say, for example, one of them is classroom management. Maybe math stations are your thing. And maybe um, classroom organization. So you could go through that list and narrow it down to the top one or two things that really just light your fire and make you want to help other people. Usually starting with one is going to help there. So start with that, make your list, figure out what you love teaching or what other teachers come to you for help with. That's also a great place to start. There's got to be somebody in your school that has asked you a question about how you do something or told you they liked a way that you did something. So start there. Okay, my next tip. Once you figure out your teaching niche, that's gonna give you so much clarity. So when I talk about your niche, that just means the thing that you are going to make your, your business center around or your product in this case. So let's go back to that math example. I'm switching to fifth grade, so I'm a little nervous about teaching, teaching fifth grade math, but let's say that you're really great at it and you have developed a system in your class for how your students do math stations. Maybe you take the whole group lesson and you do small groups and you have like a great exit tip system and you have a great way to differentiate your lessons and keep track of all the data. And you could turn that all into a TPT product or many products that help other teachers that are teaching the same thing solve that problem. And that even could turn into a mini course or a membership. You just really have to dream big here because there's so many ideas how to start with just one simple idea and turn it into a lot more. So your, your teaching niche, just like your tutoring niche, so if you're tutoring also, this is for you too, you could turn something that you're great at in your tutoring business into a product. And I encourage all of my tutors to have a TPT store. And that is why I created the course From Zero to Cha-Ching, because I wanted a way for tutors to feel like they could make extra money on Teachers Pay Teachers, and it's not just classroom teachers who are doing it. It's full-time tutors and regular tutors like you and I that are making tons of money on TPT and you can too. Okay, my next tip is to take your favorite thing teaching, just like I talked about, and then turn it into a system and a process. So maybe you're like me and you love teaching reading groups. Maybe there's something unique about how you do it that could turn into one product that could turn into multiple products, like I kind of mentioned in the last example, and just kind of streamlining it to where it becomes a method and then you have your own unique method. And that's how eventually that's how you sell a course is really by just bottling up something that you're doing and and helping people solve their problem and selling it to them because your solution is going to be what's perfect for them. OK, next, once you've created a product, turn it into a product line. I kind of weaved that in there this whole time. And I want you to think about big picture. So. 
let's say that you are creating a worksheet that solves one particular math standard. Could you then look at the whole unit of that particular subject and make a unit for it? And that's a big bundle. Could you then turn that into an entire grade level unit for that particular subject? Yes, you could. So just start small, but then let it go somewhere big. And once you create one template for something, I promise you that it gets easier and easier to recreate. Right now I'm working on some word sorts for my TPT store. Once the first one was made, they're really easy to keep making and then I can bundle each set once I have a whole set complete. And that way I can have different ways of making money. For the person that wants to just buy one lesson, great. For the person that wants the whole unit, even better. They have all of that available to them. Okay, so I just wanted to get your wheel spinning while it's summertime about turning something that's uniquely you, either in your tutoring business or in the classroom or both, That's what I always encourage my tutors to do is take their teaching gifts into their tutoring business. And once you realize that tutoring kind of has its way of just streamlining so perfectly into the classroom, it makes it really easy to not feel like an extra job and really an energizing way to make extra money on the side. But the same can be said for creating a product in your TPT store and starting your own teacher business by maybe making a course or a couple weeks ago we talked about out school and maybe starting on there so there's so many ways to expand and make extra money as a tutor and a teacher and I want to be there for you every step of the way if you're thinking about starting a TPT store or maybe you already have one but you really need some help on putting the right steps in place then I want you to check out the link I'm going to leave in the description box below for my course from zero to cha-ching. It is priced super low but it has tremendous value and the people that have been through the course already are raving about it so go ahead and check that out and I'd love to have you join us. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and tell me in the comments below, are you going to turn your unique teaching gift into a product or a course? And if so, let me know what your idea is so I can give you some feedback and help you along the way. And go ahead and hit that subscribe button too so you'll be the first to know when I have new content. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time.